हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट निकोरैंडल निकोरैंडल द मेकैनिज्म ऑफ एक्शन ऑफ निकोरैंडल इज निकोरैंडल इज अ पोटेशियम चैनल ओपनर or because it is a one it is a potassium channel opener and it is also this nicorandel also produces nitric oxide it is a nitric oxide donor also one because it is a potassium channel opener it is an arterial dilator okay because of opening of potassium channels will cause entry of potassium thus resulting in hyperpolarization leading to relaxation or dilatation of the arteries whereas nitric oxide donor because it donates the nitric oxide this nitric oxide acts on the cyclic gmp thus causing dephosphorylation of myosin light chain kinase and thus it can cause Mm, dilatation of the venules which is called has so thus it is a veno dilator so potassium channel opener is an arteriolar dilator whereas nitric oxide is a veno dilator so it is combined dilator which is dilating both the arterioles and the venules the main important thing is nicorandel does not have nitrate tolerance which is present is not seen um in nicorandel so there is no nitrate tolerance is seen in the nicorandel next this nicorandel is used in resistant angina has the first line drug if the uh, drug if the angina is not responding to either uh, um, if the angina is not responding to nitrates or calcium channel blockers in such cases we can give resistant angina we can give nico nicorandel can be given this nicorandel also causes ischemic preconditioning also that means the myocardium becomes in ischemic preconditioning the myocardium will become resistant to ischemia so because in ischemic uh, preconditioning the myocardium will become resistant to ischemia and thus the ischemia does not affect this nicorandel so this nicorandel is also used in the resistant angina and it is also used in the treatment of vasospastic angina also we can use this nicorandel thank you and thank you for watching